So, so many people sort of refer to me now as the eBay guy and so on because I've been doing so much work with eBay in the UK and now Australia. Um, but they often say, what's the one thing that you would do, Chris, that would make such a big difference to, to eBay for me? And what I've learned is that it's not just one thing, unfortunately, but, but there are some really important things that you can do. And if I was gonna pick one, I'd be looking at my warranty program. What I wanna do is build trust in my product, in my company, to the buyer. And if you think about it, most buyers that are, if you're buying something that's secondhand, that's been used before, your concerns are around, is it of the right quality? What if something goes wrong with it and so forth? So you wanna build trust. And uh, how do you build trust when you really not sitting there talking to someone they don't know you really well? Well, yeah, there's a few things you can do, but one of the main things you can do to build trust is to really have an extensive warranty program. Um, and, you know, I've got some customers that are offering 12 months warranty across the board now, except for engines, gearboxes, diffs, transfer cases, and transmissions, right? Uh, those really more expensive mechanical components. Everything else is running with a 12 month warranty. Why? Because the chances of something coming back are so low, it's, it's the best way to show that your product is good. Words are cheap, but you throw 12 months warranty up there, makes a big difference. Something you can do straight away, you don't need me to do it, you don't have to pay me to do it, you can do it. Um, and it's so low risk because the return rate is so low, the failure rate is, is nearly zero. Um, most failures happen in the first 30 to 60 days, so you're covering that anyway. It's a no-brainer. So one thing, have a think about your warranty program. Uh, do your numbers. You'll see that it's a very low-risk uh, strategy. Uh, and that's one thing you can do very quickly. Hope that helps. Cheers.